interesting. Well, there are plenty of stories in the military police unit, which we showed you returning home Friday. Casey Harrell was a part of that group, and today she returned to her job in the USA. When the soldier showed up for her first day, she got quite the surprise. 27 First News reporter Jeff Leff Coolidge takes us to the homecoming. It's the first day back to work at the Northeast Ohio Correctional Center in Youngstown for Casey Harrell, but the correctional officer was not expecting a welcome like this. Coworkers waved flags for Harrell as she walked down the hallway of the prison this afternoon. So it was a great surprise, and I really, truly appreciate it. Casey returned Friday night with the rest of the 838th Military Police Unit, who spent the last year in Afghanistan with the U.S. Army. Her family not only was on hand for the surprise party today, but also had a hand in the planning. They tell me they're just glad to have her home. But to actually see her walk off and know that she's home and secure now, that obviously meant the world. Harold is the first person ever to be deployed from the prison. You make a lot of friends when you work in a correctional institution. So we just felt like we would do something special for her because she, you know, it's very special what she did out there. And we're real proud of her. Co-workers say they tried to stay in contact with her while she was over there, even sending her care packages. Because we want to be there for her and continue through. It doesn't just stop because they're gone, nor will it stop just because she's home now. It's going to be a continual thing because it's a process now that she's home as well. Harold, who says this is her last deployment, had a surprise for the warden as well a certificate, and a flag that flew over Bagram Air Force Base in Afghanistan. In Youngstown, I'm Trouble County Bureau Chief Jeff Left Coolidge, WKBN 27 First News. Pretty heartwarming. Welcome back there. Yeah, Casey, thanks for your service. Absolutely.